there, I, I think it was mostly about the, the balance of power in my country. Uh, Mr. Macron was re-elected. He was re-elected with a very strong margin against Madame Le Pen. And they said no to Madame Le Pen. They also said no to the left and far left, united. They didn't want a majority coming from the left, although the left is stronger than it used to be. But they didn't want Mr. Macron to have, I think, all the powers uh, in his own hands. So they created a kind of check and balance system with a parliament uh, where there is a, a relative majority, but also very strong oppositions. And so uh, I think that this is not so bad uh, that Mr. Macron now needs to negotiate majorities uh, to uh, have a, a, another kind of role for himself. Uh, uh, he has understood that. You spoke about the National Council for Refoundation. This is a meeting with social partners, with political forces, uh, that I will introduce as uh, chair of the Court of Auditors uh, uh, by introducing our public finances and economic situation. Mm -hmm. uh, but the idea is to have a dialogue on the main issues of the country and try to find a consensus for reforms. So the reforms, I think, will go on but they will maybe be more balanced. But Pierre, I, well, I'm, I'm sure, quite optimistic about that. I'm sure about three jobs ago, you and I would have chatted uh, with you as the finance minister about the tricky state of the public finances in France compared with the, the average across the EU as well. And a decade or so later, they're still not where they should be. They're still not where Monsieur Macron and you would want them to be. Will they ever be? They need to be. Uh, for their, my, my role as a chair of the Court of Auditors, and also chair of the independent fiscal board in the country is to say that we must have ambitious targets and more ambitious targets as well on deficits and on debt uh, that uh, France uh, must not be uh, on the back seat uh, that France is a country that must show by example I think that Mr. Le Maire the Minister of Finance is fully conscious of that um, that the president is also fully conscious of that and that will certainly be the message that I will deliver on, uh, on Wednesday at the National Con uh, uh, Council for Refoundation, is that uh, public finances and debt matter, uh, that you cannot have good policies without good finances. And that at one moment, uh, when you are too indebted, the future generations suffer, and you cannot have the room of maneuver to act.